Second bridge. Split and hold it. I really want to see the speed in the middle, right, at the speed now. Whoever's tracking in the middle and bouncing, get to the ball quickly. The jungle ball needs to get to the jungle ball. Right. Jungle ball needs to get there quickly. Alright, ready to go? Four passing balls. One jungle ball. Here's the fourth passing ball. Actually, this can be the juggle ball. It's a little bit flat. Four passing balls, one dribble ball. Let's go, play. Yep. Chris. Let's go. 
guys are just passing the ball. Why would you do that? Oh. Yeah. Think about it now. I want you guys now to do one simple thing. <laughs> when you get the ball, do it. Okay. Not from the balance. Balance five each. Okay, we're going to our right. Jun, watch that. We're going to the end of that. And in, out, in, out. Okay, watch you get back to the ball. I want two, two balls. Run normally, come around, bounce off backwards. When you get to the end of the line, you must do one push up. That's speed. So, we're going to the right, left. Don't want to see this. Don't release the ball. Get to this point and do that. I want you running forward. Now, check. So you can see everything here and then back. Open up. Right to the end of the line, do your push up. So you must travel right, back as hard as you can. Very important. I need you to travel That's the hardest part here. You've got plenty of players to balance off. Ready to go. Oh my god, the game, you try to pass the ball, we're going to go fucking straight. That's the game. You know why I know that? Because you do an average of 100 passes in a minute and a half. Just want 15 minutes. Bang. So collectively, there's 20 people here, it's an average of about 75 passes each. And that's how many passes you make in a game, on the average, right, at a high level game. So if you can continue this pathway and thought pattern of, it's a simple pass. <laughs> If you upset the simple pass, everything breaks down. Movement is essential. You're all sweating, you're all working. It's important you understand. Release and go, release and go. Whether release and go means release and take two steps back, guess what? But still release and moving. Do never, re never release the ball and stand still. If you get that as part of your makeup, you move forward very quickly. So we're gonna play a game with you guys, 10 v 10. You can go grab a drink and come back and sort everything out and away we go. Thank you. Okay. One v one. We want to try and keep those two balls in. Once you score a goal, you have to, if you score the goal, you have to get beyond your first goal before you can re-enter the game. Does that make sense? So if I'm playing yellow and I'm going this way, turn around, and I'm the guy that scores the goal, I have to go to my other goal before I can touch the ball again. You understand what it means? Yep. It means you've got to be a defender. Yeah, <laughs> 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 
Stand within one meter of the goal to defend it. So white can start on that side. Green start on that side. Take a ball with you. Take a ball with you. Training is a it's amazing because the professional coaches, uh, co professional coaches teach teach me about oh, football. Yeah. So I want to continue. I want to continue go to the practice. So I'm I want to getting. I want I want to be getting better. So I, I think it's good. So they they are very good good player. They they, they are very good player in a. In this academy, so I wanna be, a, I wanna be getting better. So that's all. 